Well, House Republicans are escalating their investigation into the president's son, Hunter Biden, and the family's business ties with China. Republican lawmakers are looking to uncover whether Hunter's various business dealings overseas also involved his father at any point. The president denies playing any role in business deals by his son and his brother, James. Chief Washington correspondent Blake Berman is live. So, Blake, what are House Republicans laser focused on right now? Well, Nicole, this comes from Republicans on the House Oversight Committee. They say the money flow in this case what, of what they have put forward leads to more questions about Hunter Biden's business dealings while his father was the vice president of the United States. The head of the House Oversight Committee, Congressman James Comer, is centering his focus on a $3 million wire that he claims originated in China, with part of it eventually making its way to three members of the Biden family. According to bank records, Comer says he reviewed, here's how the money moved. A now defunct Chinese company, State Energy HK Limited, wired the $3 million to Rob Walker, an associate of the Biden family. Walker then sent just north of a million dollars to James Geeler, an associate of Hunter Biden. And over the next three months, Hunter Biden, Joe Biden's brother James, and daughter-in-law Hallie received incremental payments adding up to nearly the identical amount. Republicans on the Oversight Committee wrote in a report, quote, the committee is concerned about the information revealed in these bank records, including why the Chinese energy company waited less than two months after Vice President Biden left public office to send the $3 million wire. Before boarding Marine One on Friday, President Biden was asked for his reaction and offered a three-word assessment. But the attorneys for Hunter Biden don't deny there were payments, describing them as, quote, good faith seed funds. They say Hunter Biden was a private citizen who had a right to pursue his own business endeavors, adding in a statement, quote, here we go again as Representative Comer takes something old and tries to make it new by wrapping it in a wild and baseless right wing conspiracy. The accounts so dramatically listed by Representative Comer belong to Hunter, his uncle and Hallie, nobody else. Nicole, those last three words there are nobody else is important. It's because uh, the legal team for Hunter Biden there is trying to, to put a firewall between this case and uh, then Vice President Joe Biden at the time. We reached out to the White House today uh, for comment on this. They sent us back a statement in part saying that House Republicans instead should be focusing on things like lowering costs and working with now President Biden on strengthening health care. Nicole. All right. Thank you, Blake. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.